Hello there, my Gemini Collective. I hope you're having a wonderful day. What's up, Geminis? Ooh, get your beauty sleep. Get your beauty sleep. Get your beauty sleep. Oh, Geminis, God protects me and God fights my battles. No weapon formed in spirit or physical against me shall prosper. I'm highly favored and protected from all evil, as is my beautiful Gemini collective. Geminis, what's up, babies? What's up, my Gemini babies? Queen of Pentacles, Chariot Energy, Five of Wands, Three of Cups, Ten of Swords, and a five of pentacles. Ooh, Gemini, creating a little bit of chaos. You're creating a little bit of chaos here. What are you doing? Oh, wow, that chariot, the queen of pentacles, Archangel Michael energy around you. That five of pentacles, five of wands isn't you. It isn't you. What's between the five of pentacles and the five of wands? Ooh, some instability here. Hmm. Oh, this is the energy of someone don't know whether to scratch their watch or wind their butt. Remember what that's from? Yeah. That ain't you. Got some Archangel Michael energy right here. Three of Cups and the Ten of Swords. We got the Ten of Wands. Lord have mercy. Oh, Gemini's, that's almost like bulldozer energy here. You definitely clearing the path. Definitely make sure you get your beauty sleep, though. You're doing a lot of work, so you need the rest. Some of y'all, maybe you're going to try acupuncture. Um, maybe some cupping. Take care of yourself. Take care of yourself. Over top of that's a six. Six of cups. Six is your energy, your number, Gemini's. Bottom of the deck. We got the fool. We got the king of swords. We got the Hierophant energy. And we got the King of Pentacles. Oh, Geminis, be very mindful of the contracts that you sign right now. Be very mindful. Some of you, this is like, a, oh, well, yeah, we got the chariot there. Some of y'all, the riders you can get in a contract. Be very mindful. Be very mindful. You're getting an upgrade in energy, Geminis. That you are. Hierophant energy. Taking control. Being in charge. Be mindful of your contracts though, Geminis. That's like any writers you can put in the contract. That's like any uh, bonuses you can get. You know the, the actors that do the deal. They take less money up front. But they get a little bit on the back. Of like everything. And they make like a fucking fortune. Uh, it's like that type of energy, Gemini. Be mindful of the contracts. Six of Wands in the Empress energy. Some of you creative control over what the fuck it is you're doing. Be mindful of that, my creatives. Be mindful of the creative control. Definitely watch your contracts before you move forward or do anything. Ooh, be patient. Gemini's, I don't want to say play hardball here, but definitely kind of know your worth. Look into something. If you're unsure about it, look into something. Um, there's a lot of different ways you can find out what you need to find out. But uh, be very mindful of your contracts. I mean, you should know your contracts uh, like the back of your hand. Some of you know your self-worth. Don't be afraid to play hardball. But don't ask for too fucking much. Keep it realistic. Keep it realistic. Four of Pentacles energy there. It's just make sure that you're like covered. Make sure you're covered. Cost, anything like that. I don't see it being extravagant. Just kind of the basics and maybe one or two little fluff things in there. Just cause. You know what I mean? Your good though here causes conflict. 
You got five of pentacles, that five of wands, that two. Uh, there's conflict. I don't know, maybe some of y'all, there could be a bidding war to kind of get your attention. Just uh, be mindful. Six of swords, queen of cups energy. Cupping. Have any of you done cupping? Heavy on the acupuncture energy and the cupping. You know where they heat the cup and throw it on your back? Supposedly pulls out impurities. Of course, your back looks jacked up for a while, but it is like a... Uh, a form of... Uh, yeah. Healing. I don't even know what the fuck you'd call it. Hmm. What else do we have? I'm not taking that many Gemini. That's way too fucking much. What else do we have for Geminis? Did y'all see that one? Baby, you're manifesting. So drink plenty of water. Stay positive. Stay focused. Stay positive. Stay focused, Geminis. You got some good coming in, but your good is going to throw a little bit of conflict somewhere. But that could actually be to your benefit. I don't see you in the conflict. The only thing I think you've got to worry about is your contracts. Pay very close attention to your contracts. Whatever it is you agree to do, whoever it is you're working with, make sure you know what the fuck is up. Don't be stingy. This isn't don't be stingy. You don't need to be a, a diva about this. But, you know, kind of know your, know your fucking worth. Know your worth there, Geminis. Definitely know your contracts. And whatever the fuck this is, this will work its own damn self out. You just stay focusing on you. Definitely take care of yourself. Some of y'all make sure you're drinking plenty of water. Getting out there in nature when you can. Acupuncture and cupping. Someone's trying something new. Acupuncture... That's a little kind of out there, but I don't know. The cupping leaves a mark. <laughs> if you don't know what the hell that is, look it up. Uh, they heat the glass up and then they put it on your back and it pulls the skin up. Leaves like a big old uh, hickey mark. Some people swear by it. I've never done it, so I don't know. Some of y'all may be trying it. Anything else for my Gemini babies? Ah. <sighs> Gemini, Gemini, Geminis. Seven of Swords here. Gemini, stay focused. Stay focused and for fuck's sake, know what the hell is going on around you. Stay mindful. Read the read the fine print. Also, this is a stay stay sort of educated. Still be learning. Learning and growing. If you don't understand something, look into it. Remember when Iggy Azalea said when she signed her first contract that she's the one that read it and figured shit out for itself? So some of you are going to have to figure some stuff out, Geminis. It's not, uh, it's not a negative energy. You just want to be very mindful here. Be very mindful. Now, your sword's energy, Gemini. So, definitely watch any contracts. Watch any contracts. Watch any sort of hidden energy around you. Gemini, this just feels like connections. So, just be mindful. Know what the fuck you signed up for. Whatever the hell it is. Be mindful of your contracts. Be mindful of your contracts. Mm. Temperance Angel. Gemini, some of you are breaking contracts. Because this Eight of Swords here to this Four of Cuffs and this Page of Pentacles... And your temperance angel, uh, Sagittarius there, is your opposite, Geminis. So you could be breaking a contract that kept you stuck. 
You're not taking that sort of lunch invitation. You're not even, oh, you're not going anywhere near this. So, Gemini's, yours is kind of twofold. You could be getting out of a contract that was shit, or you could be going, possibly going into a contract that might be shit. So, you need to make sure you pay close attention to everything. It's going to come out on your behalf. I don't want you shook. I don't want you getting uh, upset or anything. You just need to know what the fuck is up. You need to know what's up. Because, Gemini's, it almost feels like this Eight of Swords energy is the one trying to get you on board with something that is shit. This is like uh, someone uh, purchased something and they want to dump it off on you and uh, kind of get their money back. So just be mindful of the, the energies you tap into. You're going to be good. But you're going to have to fucking be aware. Seven of Swords, be knowledgeable. Watch your contracts. Who is this Eight of Swords to Gemini? Gemini, I don't feel that's you. Because I don't feel like you're given to this energy. You're dealing with someone who's stuck in something shit. And they just kind of want to pawn it off on you. Yeah. This has to do with uh, an opportunity. But Gemini's, if it seems too fucking good to be true. Guess what, sweetie? It is. You got the Ace of Swords, the Ace of Wands, and the Ace of Pentacles right here. So, really look into your contracts. Some of y'all. I, I don't know if this Cups energy here is relationship contracts or like interpersonal contracts with people. Or if this is just where you're so used to dealing with somebody, you don't double check what the fuck they put in front of you to sign. Uh, so some of you may be changing up who the hell looks at your shit because you don't trust them. Definitely watch any contracts, interpersonal, financial, whatever you got going on, Gemini's. Now's not the time to dick around with that. You got good energy here. Damn, Geminis. I mean, you can't get no better than that. You got to be smart. Whatever the fuck it is you do, you got to be smart. Some of you with that cups energy, if it's emotional contracts, uh, you know, kind of pay attention to that. Are they really worth the time, energy, or effort? And go do whatever you need to do. Maybe it's a massage. Maybe you're going to do some cupping. Maybe you're going to do a little acupuncture. Take care of yourself. So read your contracts. If you don't understand something, figure it the fuck out and make smart choices. But if something seems too good to be true, come on, Geminis. You weren't born yesterday. You want a song? You want a song, Geminis? Ooh, sing us a song, you're the piano man. Sing us a song tonight. Ooh, some of y'all in music. Pay attention to your music. Nothing compares to you. I can't get no satisfaction. I've seen lonely times when I could not find a friend. But I always thought that I'd see you again. You gotta allow that dramatic pause in there. I don't know, Gemini. I think you've got options here. But I don't know. You could be switching up. Don't get complacent with the people that you're used to dealing with. Read the fine print. Read the fine print, Gemini's. You can ring my bell. Ring my bell. Ring a ring a ring. Oh, Gemini's. Good luck. God bless. Have a good day.